All right, welcome to my channel. This is Lock Chuck. What I'm doing today is a entry video to Random Jim's video. He said just random stuff. And this is more to vent on myself um, because I had a padlock or have a padlock that is a Yale style keyway that I didn't have a key for. So I was like, I wanted to try to decode it, and, you know, hadn't got around to it. So I kind of set it to the side and say, I'll come back to it. And well, the other day I happened to see a little bit of a sale on a leashy style, um, Yale pick. So I ordered it, um, and it came in today. So I was all right, great. Now I can decode that lock, possibly make a key for it and you know have a, a back working lock you know to share or pick on or whatever um but now i can't find the lock and it's ticking me off i mean it's like everywhere i thought i would have put it i would have put it i thought back in my organizers or I left it on my table. I remember last time I had it, I had it out here because I thought about picking it and trying to decode it without a leashy style. And I kind of said, ah, I put it to the side. I'll do it later. I'm doing some other stuff. And now that this has come, I can't find a lock. I mean, I know I can't be the only one like, like this, but it just drives me nuts. Because, you know, I try to get organized and then I can't find a dang thing. I mean, I've grabbed that lock several times. Like, oh yeah, I want to decode it. I want to decode it. And now that I got something to decode it with, which it works good. I mean, I'm not. Um. So <laughs> I don't know what a uh, what a pain in the butt. But anyway, anyway, that's kind of my ramble. I guess I'm gonna switch up and I'm gonna pin up these Asa 600s that I finally got some keys or the, the right key pins for. So I'm gonna do that and maybe I'll run across it while I'm doing that. But anyway, all right, thanks for watching.